born almost daily in this new and enlightened age. Age claimed to be the universal key to unlock our spiritual cage. It's a metaphysical revival or rebirth for whatever word sells. But it goes back beyond the tribe the Bible to the tribal fear of our own damn selves. Well, I was raised a Roman Catholic. They told me everyone else was wrong which seemed somewhat sociopathic. But hey, what the hell, I belong. It was wholesale indoctrination. Seemed like something wasn't right. But there was this pretty young nun that taught third grade that I dream about tonight. Don't give me God on a silver platter. Don't give me God. On a golden throne, I find salvation in the fame of matter. Go tell it on a mountain. Go tell it on the mountain. Leave me alone. <laughs> now I got some doubts about old Islam, but I better leave them unexplained. Or I'll be in hiding with Salmon Rushdie from Cat Stevens' new kind of train. <laughs> but you just can't talk to a zealot. Or a marketing strategy. Is it God if we can't sell it? Have you read the Celestine prophecy? Don't give me God on a silver platter. Crowds. <laughs> Between the day of souls and the Dead Sea Scrolls of Coca Pelli and Santa Claus and the Shroud of Turin and a cross in urine somewhere. I said somewhere. Something. Some little piece of the message got lost. Now, I'm not a godless person. I try to live the golden rule. You believe whatever you want to. If it don't hurt nobody, that's cool. But I've seen so much shit go down in the name of God above. Gays get bashed, cultures get trashed, push usually comes to shove. Don't confuse God with xenophobia. Love can't be rooted in hate. Now raise my glass in the hope that you all make it to heaven's gate. Don't give me God on a silver platter. Time. Go tell it on the mountain. Go tell it on the mountain.